Okay, we're going to uh, <coughs> glue the fingerboard back on the Opus <coughs> Nathan violin. And I want you to notice there's a physical stop installed here and taped in place. It'll keep the fingerboard from sliding down. And the uh, fingerboard clamps, I think these are from McDonald, uh, uh, <laughs> is it McDonald Douglas? Um, a famous uh, guitar place. And so they're uh, ready to go, basically. And I put a center line right down the center of the plate. And in my uh, warming box, I've got the fingerboard all ready to go. Notice there's a slot cut right down the center. And it could be also done on the center of the neck, just past the end block here so that the glue can come out and really get a good grip. So this is preheated. So first I'm going to uh, apply glue to the neck here. And this is uh, while I'm making glue. I'll brush an even coat on. My clamp stock up here. Okay, we want a good coverage here so it's even all the way over. Doesn't have to be in excess. We're going to do the fingerboard, do the same thing. Just an even coat on both sides. Alright, and we're just going to Move the clamps up and slide the fingerboard under and goes up against the stop here. And we're going to tighten this first clamp down and we'll center that as we go with our fingers. We want the same reveal or uh, pooch out the same on both sides here. So that feels pretty good. Then we're going to physically align the center line of our fingerboard, looking straight down on from above, and then we'll tighten the clamp up near the neck. Can okay, we check it? And as close as we're going to get. Then we're going to tighten the clamp in the middle here. Now there'll be some glue that works out and gets under the clamps, but we'll just wash it off if it cures. So I'll double check here, even there. Actually, it could go that way a little bit. It's awful close. And there's just a little bit of a ridge here, and we can scrape that down. But this side's pretty much even all the way across here, and that is centered. You can see it. So that the fingerboard will be on center. So we're going to tighten this base clamp down first, good and tight. I'll we'll tend to squeeze the glue up. And we'll sque squeeze the center clamp down good and tight, and I'll squeeze it up some more. And we'll screw down this top clamp. You can see a little bit of glue is all right. I'll double check everything. That's pretty acceptable. Okay, now I'm going to take some uh, hot water. I'll put the lid back on the glue pot so we don't accidentally dip our cleaning brush into the glue. Okay, so I'm going to take some hot water, 150 degrees Fahrenheit, and we're going to Put this joint 
going to put hot water on the outside of this joint and that will tend to uh, reset the glue and we'll wipe off the excess. Like I said, when we uh, open these clamps up, there'll be some glue here, and we'll just wash it off with hot water. All right. A little hot water on this side. We don't want to wash glue out of the joint, but we do want to. Reset the glue and uh, clean up any excess. So this, just a little wood dowel that I've clamped in here, and that keeps it from shifting down too far. So we've got our, from the edge of the nut to the center, well the front edge of the um, bridge at the top is 12 and 15 sixteenths of an inch. So standard stop for a full size 14 inch body violin. Okay, so I'm just uh, get some glue on your fingers. You can just kind of wipe it off too. And paper towel. All right. And so this is very close joint on this side. Take a little bit off the ebony here, and this goes over just by a 64th of an inch, and we'll scrape scrape that down, and then we'll have to adjust the tone on the top of the board, because that'll raise the tone of this side of the fingerboard, so we'll just scrape a little off the side to make the tap tone even. And in case there's a little bit of water in there. Okay. So that's gluing the uh, fingerboard. Uh, and a good glue joint here will ensure a good transfer of sound from the neck to the, uh, the fingerboard to the neck and into the body that way. Okay, and we'll hang that up. Let that uh, dry overnight. Okay.